With two eyes, two wheels, a sphere-shaped head, and a long neck, Inibot's QB robot is strikingly human-like and is designed to go where people go. So here he is. This is the QB, right? Correct. This is the QB. It's an ultra-mobile telepresence unit that you control via a browser. Hi. Good to see you. And it allows you to be present without having to physically be someplace. So you can be working at home while the QB is your eyes and ears at an office miles or even continents away. He walks in, attends the meeting for a little bit, can hear what's going on, can speak, can see who's there. He controls his own movement. While Anybot's $10,000 QB might be well suited for businesses, Smaller, cheaper bots are also being developed for consumers. There's Motors Galileo, Remotive's Romo, and Claire Dolunay's Botiful. Oh, can I go backwards? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dolunay is bringing her idea to reality in her Silicon Valley garage. So my invention is a small telepresence robot. It works with your cell phone and it uses Skype as a way to call the robot and to move in the other environment. Dolanay says her bot targets families with small children who can't stand still long enough for a conversation with a grandparent in front of a computer webcam. I really designed Botiful to be uh, like a cute animal that you can have uh, into your house. Dolanay is seeking funding to bring her idea to reality through the entrepreneurial website Kickstarter. Eventually, she plans on pricing her bots at $300 or less. We finally reached a technological point where the hardware is finally like cheap to do this kind of gadget. You can see it? Definitely. In the not too distant future, robots like these could be rolling up to the boardroom or the dining room. In Silicon Valley, I'm Kara Suboy, CNET.com for CBS News. Mm -hmm.